The Open in PDF Reader extension allows you to open PDF files directly in your default PDF Viewer application. To begin using this extension, we first add it to our browser. After this extension has been added to our browser, we then need to install the native client. To go ahead and install the native client, we simply scroll down here and click the native client releases. We then find the latest release, for example here, and then we select our system. So we're on Windows, so we go ahead and click Windows. Now this will download the file. Once this file has downloaded, we then drag and drop the files within the zip folder onto our machine. As you can see here. You then select the file, right click and select run as administrator. Clicking yes. Now we can see this has installed the native client as required. Now let's see this extension in action. So we can start by pinning this to our browser toolbar. Now what this allows us to do is this allows us to view the PDF file and then select the option to automatically download and open this inside our default reader. As you can see, let's automatically open this file. This extension also comes with a simple to use options panel. To use this, we simply right click and select options. Upon selecting options, we can then see a few different examples. One is to allow us to actually set a different PDF reader on our system. So rather than use the default PDF reader, we can set a specific one. So for example, I have the Foxit reader installed on my machine. So what I go ahead and do here is I add in the location of where the program is installed. So for example, this is on my C drive, inside the program files, inside the folder name, then the name that we open up, which is the executable file. We can validate this is correct by selecting the validate button. Here we receive the message that everything looks good. So we then go ahead and we can save this. Now, when I go back to the page, now when I select this option, we can see the PDF is downloaded and automatically open inside the Foxit reader rather than via Adobe. We can also set additional options within this panel as well. For example, one option is to allow the capture of the left click on PDF links. So what this essentially means is rather than having to click the button or to right click and select PDF, it basically auto detects any PDF link that we click and automatically download and open it. If we go ahead and navigate back to a PDF link here, let's see what happens. So now we left click, we can see the file is automatically downloaded and then it's automatically open inside Foxit as demonstrated. And it's as simple to use as that. As I say, it's important to make sure that this extension works correctly by installing the native client to begin with.